Shalom. Welcome to our daily blessing. It is a good thing to give thanks unto the Lord, O Most High. Great is the Lord and greatly to be praised. In every situation that you are in, you should give glory to God and give God the praises. Not only in good times, but even in bad times, even in down times, you should give glory to God and praise Him that He will intervene for your situation. Yesterday, I talked to you about the blessings in, obe in obedience. I would love to go through a little bit more again. The Bible says in uh, Deuteronomy 28 verse 1, Now it shall come to pass if you diligently obey the voice of the Lord your God to observe carefully all His commandments which I command you today, that the Lord your God will set you high above all nations of the earth. Wow, what an awesome God it is. And if you look at verse 15, of chapter 28 but it shall come to pass if you do not obey the voice of the Lord your God to observe carefully all his commandments and his status which I command you today that all these curses will come upon you and overtake you there's two sides in a coin like most people say one's a positive and negative one's blessing one's cursing obedience and disobedience it's not so much of all these things. What is matter is you are walking in line with the word of God, obeying the voice of the Lord. When you obey the voice of the Lord, the Lord will begin to open heaven for you. Even though in the difficult times, sometimes you know you obey God and you are walking with God, you're paying your tithes, you're loving people, you are doing God's work, and yet the trouble comes because the devil doesn't want you to be successful. And yet, sometimes the Lord allow you to go through the suffering because He wants to prune you, He wants to make you, He wants to glorify His name through you. And that's why when you obey, continue to obey God's word and that God can bless you in your coming in and your going out. In verse 9, the Lord will establish you as a holy people to Himself, just as He has sworn to you. If you keep the commandments of the Lord your God and walk in His ways, he wants you to be a holy people. He wants to boast about you. He wants to glorify His name in, through you. And so that is why people of God, stand strong, hold fast. This is the Lord. Let's do it. Let's go for it. And the Lord will come in your needs, in your aid. And God is a good God. He loves us. He cares for us. And so I want to challenge you. Stand strong, stand firm. Let me pray with you. Father, I thank you for your goodness, your mercy. I give you praise, God. The Lord, you will open to us the, your good treasures in heaven to give rain to the land and in seasons and to bless all the work of our hands. So, Father, I thank you, Lord, that you will bless their hands. Everything they touch, let them be blessed. Where they are feet treads upon, let them be blessed, God. Let them enlarge their territories, enlarge their lands, that your name may be glorified. And Lord, most of all, Lord, those who are sick in body, those who are going through difficult times, stressful situations, emotional stress, Lord, I pray you intervene in their situation. And Lord, I pray by your stripes they have been made whole. That you will give them the strength and the ability to stand strong and go through and come out strong and victorious, oh God. Lord, I thank you, Lord, by those who are sick in body. In the name of Jesus, we speak healing. Rise up and walk. Pick up your men and walk. Rise up in the name of Jesus. By faith, trust God. And let the healing begin in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. I thank God for you. I thank God for your strength. I thank God that your faith is there holding on. That you will see your miracle at hand. In due season, your miracle will come. Even if it's not yet, it will come. And I want to thank you. I want to thank you for your faithfulness. Because you are standing strong and God will do the miracle for you. He will give you the breakthrough. He will bring you victory and most of all glorify him in everything that you do 
wherever you are share and testify of his goodness of his mercy of his grace that your miracle will come to you so remember god is a good god he loves you and he wants you to be a blessing to somebody else so that your miracle will come i speak life to your spirit i speak your miracle to come to pass in the name of jesus amen Hallelujah, how great God is and how good it is. Let's give thanks to the Lord for all the miracles and all the situation or over everything. Let's surrender to the Lord and let's praise His name. The Lord will be glorified in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you. I'll see you tomorrow.